Arguably one of the Land of Enchantment's favorite restaurants, Sadie specializes in authentic New Mexican cuisine. The restaurant outgrew two previous locations and for the past 20 years has been a New Mexico institution on 4th Street in Northwest Albuquerque. Sadie's welcomes diners with a casual, comfortable atmosphere and large portions of traditional New Mexican favorites. I love the red chili enchilada, but I've tried it all. It's all good. But the carne alivada and the uh, quesadillas are the, my favorite. Absolutely. I've always been treated like one of the family. I've been here about 15 years. It's a fun place to work. Nice and easy, nice and fun. <laughs> Are you in the mood for some great New Mexican food that will always satisfy your appetite? If so, bring the whole family to Sadie's. Well, Brian, this is really a treat for me to be here at Sadie's with you. I don't even want to tell you how many years it's been that I've been coming here since you were in the bowling alley right behind this building, and that's a lot of years ago, right? This is your 20th year here in this location, right? That's correct, uh, Richard. It's 20 years in this location, and I can't even believe it myself. And You know, we were in the bowling alley for 15 years, and before that, our actual original location was down on 2nd and Osuna. Uh, the building's still standing there. It's a little tire shop now, and uh, my, my Aunt Sadie and my mom, uh, Betty Jo, uh, started that uh, business, that restaurant, back in the early 50s, like in 1954. Today, we wanted to try some different things that you do, and you can see that when you come to Sadie's, you never leave hungry, right? Oh yeah, we always give big per big portions, uh, plenty of chips and salsa, sopapillas, you know, we, we've got some sides of chili here, and uh, you got the sopapilla burger, I got the taco burger, um, these are big sellers for us. Well, they, the other thing about the what you have here are the sopapillas. So you start with this, you end with this, and you've got all this great stuff in the middle. That's another thing about, about Sadie's. Um, you know, you get your meal, you get your sopapillas at the end, and, and again, it's just, it's a lot of food, but it's really good food. Potatoes. We have to talk about the potatoes. Yeah, uh, these are papitas, uh, little cubed uh, diced potatoes that we deep fry. Uh, they come with um, a lot of the dinners. Uh, you can get them on the side. We go through about 600 pounds of potatoes a day here in the restaurant. We also have a home style french fry and then we make our own potato chips. There is always something new going on at Sadie's and I hear some music in the background. I think that's fairly new here, isn't it? Yeah, we've been having live music on the weekends um, for, I'd say, a little bit over a year now. And um, in our lounge, it's a great atmosphere in there, uh, uh, Fridays and Saturday nights. Um, we, we have live music in there. Um, on the weekends, it's a great place to come and watch the game. We have the NFL Sunday ticket in there. We've got six or seven TVs. So, I mean, there's always something fun and exciting going on at, at Sadie's. We also have uh, the world's largest stuffed sopapilla. Uh, it's about six pounds, and if you eat it all, it's free. Well, Brian, Sadie's one of my all-time favorite places to go for in a lot of years, and it will continue to be that way in the future. And Ginger, you're going to have a great time cooking with Brian today. I can promise you that right now. I don't know about you, Brian, but I'm going to dig into this because it's too good not to. Richard, Brian, you're making me hungry. Get down here and let's start cooking.